Hey guys, welcome back to Sky Factory. Not Reloaded 3. Yeah. 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 How you guys doing? Um, I did a bit of work off camera. We're breeding up our nether quartz chickens, uh, which I've been told are the only ones we need, which is cool. Um, we're up to, I think, five-ish. I want to get these to ten before I start breeding out the other chickens. I also made a Lapras one. Uh, I think this guy drops Lapras, but I'm not sure. Uh, I finished the coal guys, so the coal ones are producing here. I switched out these middle ones for double ones and put a void, hopper, uh, void upgrade in them. Uh, that way I can have like this row for these ones here and these ones for here. And then this middle one will be for the eggs for both sides of it. And that should that should be nice. Uh, the only thing is I will have one extra here for some something. I don't know. Maybe we need a small amount of something. I'll just put the chicken nest on top and feed directly in. And then we can do the same thing on this side. And that should be cool. Um, yeah, nifty. So these guys are producing away like stack almost two stacks of coal i just finished these guys like this guy's just grown up so that's pretty good um we we've a ridiculous amount of iron now like it's it's silly uh i got a load of glowstone from those as well and i've just been harvesting this field whenever i can so that i can make more of these uh nesting pens here um and right now i was just shoving uh this gravel through to get some sand um, because we want sand for the next project we want to do so next project we want to do uh, is pretty similar to what we're actually what we did on Wednesday uh, which is a blaze farm um, yes uh, blaze farm which you know I don't really like to do the same thing in both series, but it's kind of what we need right now. Uh, we have three generators here, and we're going to make a fourth one, of course, later today. Um, as is our kind of our, our aim is to get one new generator every episode until we have all 16. And then we can make the rainbow generator, which should be super. Uh, we are currently not producing. We pretty much only produce excess power when this thing has redstone and i just drop redstone in here whenever um whenever i kind of have it or whenever i need power uh let's just quickly uh swap this guy out here this is a 545 and this is yeah let's just put him yes Sweet. Um, yeah, so let's get started on this. We just, we, we basically, I'm going to put a blaze farm just over here. I'm hoping it won't be that noise, but I think we can get uh, mob n n sand mufflers. The sand muffler might work for the blazes if, if it gets to that point. I don't actually play with sound on, which is, which is why I, I, you know, never really noticed this stuff. Um, but yeah, we're going to build this thing over here. I, ha I should have enough stuff on me. I just want to get the rest of this sand because I want to make. Oh, you can't alloy that anymore. That's annoying. Uh, the furnace is there. Yeah, so we'll make a ton of glass, I think. Um, and. Sure. Uh, I want to just make the whole thing in glass, basically. So we're going to go off this way, uh, probably here. Let's grab some stairs, actually, because I want to go up these ones here. So let's just knock out this bit here. Should be fine. And stairs up. I think we only want to do two stairs, so that's fine. Yeah, that should be fine. And then we'll just um, branch off here. Uh, we probably should have done this three wide because we need an even, uneven amount, whatever. Uh, 
honestly, it's it's pretty much going to be exactly the same as the one I built on Wednesday. So I might just cut here while I build up the structure and then we can come back in a second and uh, have a look at how it went. Um, so if you haven't seen the episode on Wednesday, I'd probably go back and see the one on Wednesday. It pretty much has the same thing. I'm going to build out this platform now. And uh, we are going to slightly be different, but um, we'll come back and show you how different in a second. But uh, yeah, so I'm going to just build up this to here. Um, I'm going to build out this platform about 9 by 9 probably 10 9 by 9 should be fine uh, which means that this uneven amount is going to this even uneven amount is going to be very annoying but anyway I, is that 3? is that what this is? or have I been doing 3 everywhere? yes I have okay let's make this 3 that way it will be even just so it won't annoy me and many many other people uh, there we go three by three much better and there's the block there and fence there like that yeah uh, probably want to just do this I mean, we're, we're just doing some silly things now. So, yeah, yeah, okay. Let's cut here. And we'll come back in a second now. Uh, let's just check the... Yeah, that's fine. Uh, we'll come back in a second. And hopefully I'll have the whole thing nicely done out. And, yeah, cool. Okay, guys. We have this all done out here. Uh, this should work. Um, the... Uh, yeah, it, it should work. Let's just leave it at that. Uh, let's just drop down here and try get this thing in. It's probably going to be a bit difficult because of these things are going to fly me all over the place. Oh, yeah, no, this is really difficult to do. Uh, especially because I can't seem to get under here. There we go. There we go. Uh, and I was thinking I might actually upgrade this thing to be the uh, Ender Utilities version of this thing using the Drop of Evil. Um, I've never used one of these on the spawner, and I think it could be cool to do so. Uh, wow, compressed blaze. So let's just check this out and see what we're getting. We are get oh, <laughs> yeah. Let's just take those out. We're getting blaze rods. Uh, we should be getting other stuff as well. Uh, yeah, we're getting essence, but blaze rods is the main thing we need. But let's oh. Uh, let's uh, just change this to a let's let, let's use the drop of evil on this we can always get more so does it break it oh oh I didn't know it broke it that's interesting so it's a blaze we can give it a speed upgrade or tell it to be on for just a... Ah, oh, we can give it speed upgrades. Speed upgrades would be cool. So I'm going to put this here. So this should turn it on, right? Or is there something else I have to do? Did I just mess this up completely? Oh, hang on. Is this, is this already using power? Do I need power to run this thing? put the the wire straight on it I oh, we can't did I mess up something here oh and I just broke that damn it huh Right, uh, maybe I need some, like, generators or something. Let's just get some stone bricks so I can put this thing back. I mean, I know it's 
not on powered, but it should be working, right? Right? Huh. Okay, uh, I may have to look up this because I didn't think it used power, but like it probably does. It makes sense that it does. In which case, we'll have to get some ender or extra utilities power generation going. Oh, hang on. Yeah, something happened there. It's just slow, is it? Very slow. So some speed upgrades. Yeah, speed upgrades probably. Oh, we're getting loot bags from these things as well. Uh, okay. Yeah, I forgot about that. Like all we really want from this is the blaze rods, yeah? Yeah, hmm. This is very slow. Like I think this is slower than a, a regular one. The only difference is I believe it works no matter where I am, so that's probably a, a good... Look at that. That's weird. Anyway, okay, uh, let's look into getting some uh, water mills. So we need a resonator. And for resonator, we need these crystals, uh, block of coal. Yeah, the crystals are fine, and the, yeah, that should be okay. Um, oh, there's a lot of them though coming out, and it is working. Let's uh, let's sleep a bit, and um, then we will look into getting some of these mills going. I think I've never used these stuff, so I'm I'm kind of looking forward to it. Um, and some extra utilities power will probably be a good idea anyway. Okay, let's let's let that go and uh, wait. Does this need the correct light level? Maybe is that what it is? Because it it seems to be spawning a lot more near that. I mean, that could be it. I was sure blazes spawn at any light level, but maybe the refurbished ones don't. Okay, look, listen, we'll, we'll upgrade the speed and we'll see it then. Okay, so we have the manual mill here and I'm just gonna put it here. I know they don't have to touch each other, but we can generate this like this and it generates power, but it's it's not stored or anything like that. So let's, um, let's just make 16 of these. So we're using this and it's using Oh, it, it will use as much as you can give it. Oh, interesting. And we have... <laughs> ah, so it needs like 8 GP. Okay, so we need like... Uh, we need 6 of these to make one water mill. And... Uh, yeah, this might take a while. There's three. Okay, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. So once we have these, we can make a water mill with the stuff that I have in my inventory, basically. Um, and then once we have a water mill, I believe we can just create power for this constantly. Um, yeah, okay. One more and we can make this water mill. And then this thing will wor work without us having to hit this button the whole time. Well, it's up. You just have to click. So there's six. Cool. Uh, so the water mill then. Water mill. I should have everything. Yes. And we have a thing of water. So let's put this. I feel like we're going to need like an area to put all these water mills and stuff. Um, oh, you know what I could do? Uh, I 
if I've used all my lapis though. Oh, here we go. Perfect. Yeah, let's make some more of this blue glass and we're gonna put it underneath. Uh, we've loads of slanted. Cool. So yeah, let's let's just drop down here for a second. Oh no, well we'll put it on this layer actually. We'll put uh we could put it here actually. Uh, we're gonna want like two or three of these things, uh, I believe, but we can like put them together. So, oh, not bookmark N, yeah. We can put this down here. So if we put the mill just right in the middle here, and then I believe if we just place one bucket of water over here. Generating 14, wow. Yeah, that's that's a lot better. <laughs> and then we'll just put this blue glass over it then. Uh, so we can see the mill the whole time. And then I believe um, we can just extend this here and put another one there and another one there. And it should be good. Um, we need it but yeah cool so this is generating a load now and we could probably even give it more by clicking this yeah i don't think that speed is up though cool so now we want the speed upgrades of course um so speed upgrades So the block of redstone and gold is fine, and then we just need the weighted pressure plates. So let's just grab a whole pile of gold, and we can chuck these away for now. And we need probably more redstone. There should be loads over here, and if not, there's loads in the, the um, yeah. Ooh, wow. Let's make a couple of these, I think, is probably the way to go. Let's make, like, this many. Fifteen of these. Uh, actually, let's make sixteen. We just need one more piece, there's a couple of pieces more of redstone. Oh, no, we just need nine. Cool. So then we just have to make these pressure plates into the, with this thing. Like so. And that should get us enough to do stuff with this. <laughs> um, this, this, and once we have these, yes, we've won there. Boom. Uh, so this uses one GP per upgrade, I believe, uh, according to this thing. Uh, we can probably put speed upgrade in here. Ah, but now it's using too much, so I have to actually We might have to make some more water mills as well, I think, probably. Um, yeah, so uh, let's try putting some of these upgrades into the spawner then downstairs and uh, see what it happens. I actually want to let this finish first though because I want to see how much power drain it's going to use um, and how many we can actually put in here. So uh, let me come back in a minute once these things are finished crafting then. Uh, I'll put, can I put two in here? Will it work? Yeah. Oh wow, actually that is so much faster. 
Hello. Nice. Yeah, wow. Ah, there we go. We're done. <laughs> that was easier. I didn't even have to cut. Uh, yeah, so 40... Oh, yeah. We have two in here. Let's grab these two. So let's uh, drop down here. Uh, let's uh, mine this thing. And let's uh, turn this to redstone on. And let's put uh, one... Let's max this thing out uh, with how many we can do. Because we're generating 14 and this should... Yep, that, that looks like it's a bit better. Oh uh, yeah, I think these ones here on the side should probably go to the side as well. Let's uh, let's fix that as well. Yeah, cool. Uh, yeah, let's. Oh, we can't really go down here. Do we have any spare glass? We have some spare glass over here. I probably should get some silk touch really on my uh, pick, so that I can pick up this glass that I seem to repeatedly want to use for some reason. Do this one and this one. I'm gonna push those in as well, so that they hit the um, the center ones as well. Uh, I think. Ow! 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 I don't have any of those on me. I do have them on the meat. They're literally on my hot bar. How did I not miss those? Uh, oh! Ow! 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 ow. Yeah, so that should probably work better, I'd say. Uh, okay, cool. And let's just seal this back up. Here, put the stone bricks back in and put the switch back in. And turn it back on. Yeah, look at it go. Look at it go. I am. I'm literally out of health. Wow. Uh, yeah, cool. That does seem to be working a lot faster now. Uh, I think maybe, I mean, enchanting these with luck or looting or something would probably be a lot better. But yeah, that seems to be running. Cool. Uh, so I'm going to just sleep now and see if these things work in the daytime. Um, because that's, that, that was what I was looking for. Okay, I think I think I've messed up here then. I think this actually needs to be dark inside. Damn. Yeah. Crap. I assume that was because this one is probably darker. Oh well, it doesn't it seems to be still spawning some, but but only in that spot right there because it's probably underneath here okay that's annoying i thought i could do this in glass because of the blade spawners i believe i thought they did but maybe they don't maybe i'm completely wrong okay guys um i might have to redo the roof and stuff in that uh slab it or something maybe yeah i'd say that's probably the best thing to do Okay, guys, I'll come back in a minute now and uh, we'll uh, hopefully have something that's at least spawning something in the night time. Um, I'm just going to make some stone here and uh, we'll come back once I have that done and then we will work on the next um, generator. Okay, guys, so uh, I slapped it up. It does seem to run a bit better now that um, it's a bit darker in there. Um, as in, it it actually spawns stuff. But uh, I've also gone ahead and made myself some ender chests, which was the second reason why we were actually making this thing. So let's just break this thing and let's replace it with an ender chest. And uh, let's shove on the ender collector on top of it and shove everything back in there. Um, 
because we are going to uh, yep yep that's everything right yes cool so we're gonna just take this and go down here uh fuel is on 20 percent. that's fine and down here i've already made a drawer for the blaze rods um so we are just gonna plug this thing straight in here and uh Uh, we're just gonna smack uh, an ender chest right here um, Yeah And uh, whoop. Glad I have a jetpack. Uh, let's just extract from this always active Yeah, so that should be pulling from there It should be pulling from there it is yes, yes so uh this should be filling up this thing then which it is and uh yeah so then the second thing we want to do is we have a second set of ender chests here which are just white 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 uh, i might change that at some point but we're gonna put these on here and uh hopefully i have the right thing i got some advanced item filters um so hopefully i can put these things in and tell them how many of them Huh. It's not exactly what I wanted to do. Um, I might look at the item translocators instead because I know these things can do what I want to do. Oh. Yeah, these things. Let's let's let me just make up a few of these because I know these can do what I want to do, which was just keep a stack one stack in this thing. So, um, yeah, I still have this. Oh, it's configured, though. Uh, yeah, cool. So let, let me just quickly see if I can uh, craft up these and if these are the right things that I want. Okay, so these things work exactly how I thought they would. Uh, I think I actually have one there. I don't know where that dropped from. I think it actually drops from something. Yeah, it's on the loot tables for epic bags. Uh, and then we actually want to do the same thing over here with um let's just get rid of that with uh zombie flesh for the um the other one so if we put another one there we need to put it in regulate mode which is a diamond nugget i was trying to use a diamond on it uh we want to put this one in stack mode and then we can uh just put 64 of these here uh turn that to receive mode and there we go this should always maintain 64 almost instantly which is awesome uh if i do this yeah that's fine um yeah cool so now we want to head back over to our generators and hook up the next generator that we have right here in our inventory already uh we do need some power cables though uh we have power cables here sweet so we want to hook up this one and also the new one and we'll probably put the new one right here right beside this and this is simply going to be burning blaze rods and this one is almost empty of oh i don't know how that happened yeah so this one's almost empty now let's uh let's get rid of this uh hopper here and um so we can make sure this thing is working properly and we'll put down this ender chest that we have here, the white, white, white one. And then we can just use these item translocators then to uh, feed into both of these, I think. Oh, no, no, we can't. These things do not use the same sidedness again. <sighs> Sigh. Um, seriously? Okay, let's get another hopper then, um, because that's probably the easiest way of doing this. Uh, I don't think I have a hopper. I have everything I have, need to make a hopper. Well, not really everything, but yeah, we can easily make them. With lots of lots and lots of stuff. Sweet. So we're gonna feed into hoppers then instead. 
uh, which should be fine. Yeah, it should be fine. It will keep... Yeah, cool. Uh, we'll just put it like this then. No, 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 no. Let's put it like... Yes, I didn't drop any. Good. Um, let's put it just like this. And we can just put it like this. And hopefully, yeah, these things, these things will take. Uh, so we will put, um, I lost on my glowstone. Glowstone, we need probably two pieces, I think. Oh no, we only need one piece, actually. So we need to put the glowstone on this one. And then we need to turn these into regulate mode. Uh, so this one, I need blaze rods. And this one, I need zombie flesh. We actually have loads of zombie flesh on us. So, zombie flesh. And this one, blaze rods. And you can hold shift and it goes up by some weird ass amount that I have no idea. Let's chuck that in there. And then if we just change this to receive and this to receive these things should keep these things with a stack in here and a stack in here we could probably even change this to just one on these but anyway so this should start be generating this is generating 24,000 RF at 40 a tick it's pretty good that's actually really good you know I should probably have been using blaze rods in the other series uh, but yeah this thing should be so the undead generator now should be perfectly running all the time as should the furnace generator and because the mob farm should be keeping these things active the whole time uh that should be good uh the thing we might want to do is i don't know we might want to put curse dirt down there that way that thing should be turbo powered um but i don't really think there's any necessary for that the only thing is i don't know how much yeah i think we should be okay but guys that is oh no i really shouldn't have flown up here <laughs> it's quicker taking the lift but that is all we have time for for today uh we now have four generators hooked up which is pretty cool in my opinion and um yeah cool and we have our blaze farm sweet so guys i'll leave it there and i'll see you next time